is insane the amount of people that say on social media all i've done was just go to the gym and i've been working my ass off in the gym listen stop with the lies we all know you went through surgery we all know you went to go and link up with dr phil and get your thing done it's not gym it's not gym Before I even start the video, let me save this from now. I might even sound like a broken record because I've said this before, but I'm going to keep on saying it as long as I have this channel. Ladies, it doesn't matter if you don't have some hourglass figure, if your waist isn't tiny, if your ass isn't fat, if your breasts are, it doesn't matter. Let's not get it twisted. You've seen it all on Instagram. It's making you feel insecure about your own self. Let's keep it real. But I don't ever want you to feel like you are less of a person because you don't have a small waist, because you don't have big breasts. Don't ever feel like that one bit. It doesn't matter what other people are saying as long as you feel comfortable in your own skin, as long as you you feel sexy when you look into that mirror that's all what matters that's all what matters ah man let's get into the video if you enjoyed this video if you agree with anything i have to say i want you to leave a thumbs up leave a thumbs up and leave a comment down below but if you don't agree with anything i say don't get angry let's have a conversation leave a comment down below and let me know your opinion let's have a conversation in the comment section so today we're going to be talking about real bodies versus fake bodies in 2018 we're seeing it all over social media we're seeing it everywhere a few women are getting their ribs removed because they want to have a smaller waist. Plastic surgery, there's bum implants. There's so many things going on nowadays, which is, I'm not even gonna say it's crazy because some people do it for other reasons. You might see a girl with small breasts throughout her whole life. She's been feeling insecure about her breasts and now she's gone into plastic surgery. She has implants in and it just makes her feel more confident within herself, which I can't knock her for that. I can't, I can't say no, don't do it. If that's what you want to do, that's what you want to do. Who am I to tell you you can't do that? But there's other women out there that go to the extreme. They get their lips done. They get their breasts done. They get their ass done. They get a few ribs removed so their waist can get smaller. And do you know why? Because they're trying to keep up with social media. They're trying to keep up with that Instagram body. And I am here to tell you, you don't have to do all of them things. Coming from a man, I am telling you, most men don't care about that. Me personally, I like my girls to be natural. That's just me. There's other guys out there, they want their girls to have big lips and a fake ass and Listen, men don't care about them things. We really don't care about, if anything, I've seen some crazy things on social media where the girl actually looked better when she didn't have any form of surgery, any form of surgery. But as I said before, I am not knocking it. If the whole of your life you've been feeling insecure because let's say you had small breasts and now you've gone through surgery and your breasts are how you've always wanted them to be, I can't knock you for that. But the women out there that are going crazy with it, crazy with it, no, no. There's 14, 16 year olds out there on Instagram looking at their phone thinking, I want a body like that. Genetically, you probably won't have a small waist. Genetically, you probably won't have a big bum or big breast, but I need you ladies to just live with it and love yourself it is insane the amount of people that say on social media all i've done was just go to the gym and i've been working my ass off in the gym listen stop with the lies stop with the lies we all know you went through surgery we all know you went to go and link up with dr phil and get your thing done it's not gym it's not gym you got surgery done be honest about it be real with it stop selling these young ladies dreams about all you need to do is go to the gym where you actually went to the hospital and got certain things done yeah that's what i'm frustrated about that's what i'm annoyed about <sighs> flipping out man it's a so to sum everything up surgery in 2018 is going a little bit too far but if you're doing it because you feel insecure about certain things the whole of your life you probably got bullied or something like that and you're going through surgery i can't knock you for that i can't tell you no don't do it i would say love yourself but me personally 
Forget the surgery, ladies. Forget the surgery. Go to the gym. Build the body that you want by going to the gym. Build the best version of yourself. That's what I want you to do. That's what I want you to do. Because it can be done. Hard work, patience and consistency, it can be done. Instead of doing the shortcut way and messing up your whole body with plastic surgery. Because once you do it, you can't go back. You can't go back. Then bum implants, you can't go back. Removing them ribs, it's a... No. But that is the video all done. Fake versus real. I want you guys to leave a comment down below and let me know what's on your mind when it comes to this topic. If you enjoyed the video, if you agreed with anything I said, please leave a thumbs up and share this with all of your friends because I need my message to be heard. I need it to be heard. Alright guys. Peace.